I would have very good words for our CEO, uh, Antonio Bugo, for the seven years he has served this uh, organization. He has really uh, brought it up very well uh, in the rim light, and I think we actually uh, have a vehicle that uh, brings our minds together in terms of capacity building and even helping the government in uh, bringing these people together and bringing minds together and harnessing uh, the various ideas that people have. He's a visionary leader, someone who has been able to bring together uh, the national government and the counties so that we can drive the water and sanitation agenda together. Uh, my friend, uh, see you, uh, Anthony, and gentleman, he has a passion for water and he talks with passion. If you look at Article 43 of our Constitution, it is succinctly clear mm -hmm. that every citizen in this country has a right. right. And that right is to safe and clean water. Mm -hmm. so He's so dedicated and for the time that I've worked with him, I've seen how committed he is and I've no doubt where he's moving to. You still continue with the same spirit. He's one person who knows what he wants at the end of the day. So especially when it comes to conference, he knows what he wants and he'll make sure it's delivered. Uh, we've been able to grow and champion the skills in the water utilities where we have skills competition. And uh, he had a way of uh, even looking at challenges. Uh, not looking at the challenge per se, but how do you come out victorious? Water and climate change are uh, inextricably linked. Under the guidance of the CEO, Mr. Mbugo, we've been able to raise the profile of WASPA and the activities that we do, which are cross-cutting both locally and internationally. We've been able to amplify the, the benchmarking role that WASPA plays. Is that kind of uh, a leader who wants to see uh, his employees or the people who are under him grow all the way professionally, spiritually, and also the social part of it. He carries the staff along with him. We all look for greener pastures. I'm happy for him, and I pray that wherever he goes, he's able to develop also on the other side. 